Let's take this guy out of the way. Today we are not reviewing the Mavic Pro. Yep, something that the Maverick Pro uses. It's from Smart Tree, and if all goes well, this thing will blow your mind. I'll tell you why. It is an ND filter uh, for 816, a usual are the most common classes. But this is the basic thing you will ever need. Some people never ever use the others. Actually, I usually stick to the 16. This is like sunglasses. It's too hot or the sun is too strong and you put on dark shades. That's what this does. Because the sun will kill the picture quality of the drone. 4K drone can become can start to look like HD when um, you don't have the right glasses on it. So this company, they believe they got something that will make your footage look like never before. Plus some other protective protection for your lenses and all that. So we are going to review all their claims and see if it's a product that you will want to get and that we will do the conclusion at the end of this video so keep watching uh, this is a good time to subscribe to the channel if you just uh, if you're new here um, we do music movies and more when I say music music videos um, music videos movies short movies um, documentary and all that stuff that's what we do like a production outfit but 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 we run this youtube channel okay and i say we because even though i'm the lone star here but yeah we it's gonna be a we very soon because we're gonna be teaming up with a couple of people you know um as soon as we can all right so um but i'm used to that i used to have a team of about um 10 staff back home in nigeria and yeah, I'm used to the we, so I still talk like we're together. And then, you know, while I'm trying to raise the we, yeah, you could connect with me if you're in LA uh, and you you like to have constant production and stuff like that. From make, ranging from makeup to videographers and stuff like that. Editors, you could connect with me and all that. But I digressed. Um, hopefully, not enough to let you be out of here. So we're going to test these guys on this, um, my lovely bird. Um, and uh, I'm so satisfied with the Mavic Pro. I ain't getting no two. All right. I mean, 4K footage is 4K footage. You could treat it. And I mean, you don't have to go with every wind and try to get everything that's out there. If you haven't gotten a drone before, you probably want to go with the new um, Mavic Pro 2, but I'm not jumping around. And just so you know, uh, the regulation involves putting a physical uh, registration, your registration code physically on the drone, not hidden somewhere prominent. So I gave them a signboard right here. You can't miss that, okay? M50, can you kindly focus on it? Is that good enough? I guess. All right, you can come back to me now. Good boy. Here's the triad here. You can't tell the difference, I guess. You know, um, let's put a smile on the drone's face and see how, how that plays out. We're gonna fly it in a minute. So I'll put each one um, on it and go fly around and come back and we will see the footages of each one now so uh, but let's let's see how how we put this on now i i think i lost my um because this is fragile you need to hold it down so that you can you know otherwise you use your hand but i'm going to just uh, go look for it for a minute um one minute well i couldn't get it so i guess uh can take that out of the way even further. Uh, I guess I'll use my hands. Out. ND16. You want to do this with your lens upside down. 
I'm gonna support it from with the back of my hand from behind and uh, put this guy on neatly, hold it tight, and I press it in, and we are in. All right, nice and easy. Okay, we did it. Now let's look for look at this guy. Give me a good look, boy. Thank you. All right, come back to daddy. I advise to use the uh, gimbal holder um, and then while that is there, still holding the gimbal holder, uh, you put on this stuff. But um, I just improvise right now. So let's go take a flight with the 16, 8, and 4 um, and see how well the the pictures are uh, but um, just uh, before we do that let's take let's let's find out what they what they say this can do once again this is from smart tree um, it's called smart tree filters compatible for DJI uh, Mavic Pro of course they have the Mavic Pro 2 platinum and all the other uh, kind of filters uh, but this one is for the one I have so that's what I, I can review um, so we'll see and it's did I mention it's $28.99 like 29 bucks right that's cheap I mean not for one single one you have a um, the three in one all right so you can't beat that but let's see what these pictures are like. Now here's what they, what they say they can do. It's got precision design. It's got multi-coated optic lens, which minimizes reflections and flares and improves image quality. Now, they usually it's a Polaroid one, but they are telling you that these ones as ND filters, they double as, you know, um, flare reflectors which like they minimize the reflections from from surfaces like car the bodies of cars top of water you know how the water looks and stuff like that so um, yeah which is good which is very good like you know hyperbole hydrophobic nano coating whatever that is reduces fingerprints and fog oh that is good water and dust all right so which means if dust comes on it it has a way of not allowing dust stay on it you know when i put it on you probably my fingerprints will be on it but they're trying to say that when you get your footage it will not show in your footage like it has the ability to you know filter out that stain on the lens or on the cap or on the filter and make it your picture still look good which it's a plus it can be left you could start it up and you know start it up and shut it down while the lens is on and we're going to do that in a minute because the gimbal will shout if it's not uh, friendly with it it will like give error messages so not all filters can start up with your lens by the way mm. we have quality warranty all right they got warranty high quality aluminum lens frame lighter and stronger durable aluminum construction and crystal clear glass offer more professional and clearer image all right so we'll see so first of all we turn it on here i won't be able to show turning on with the other um, filters i'll just show you when i do and then i'll be back here to like conclude on my findings of the uh, uh, after I watch the footages and uh, I'll tell you what I think and then you know you'll tell me what you think as always I appreciate that feedback um, now we're just gonna it's been a while I turned this guy on I lost my drone like for a day I found it again came back to data yeah just like my M50 that wasn't lost, that was damaged. But this actually flew away and said, see you tomorrow. All right, so here we are. 
it's connected. So we turn this guy on. Um, all right. I'll turn this guy on. Let's look at the lens here. It's calibrating. Looking good. All right. Let's go. So everything looks clear. You can turn it on with the with the um, ND filter on. We got this all set up. We we'll go take some footages, and we'll ride back. Maybe tomorrow or next to get a conclusion. Watch out for our songwriting lessons. That's what's gonna be this on this board. That too. I said we do music, movies, and more on this channel. So, um, yeah, of my followers on Facebook who know me to do that has been asking for that. So I've got to give them what they want, which I and I hope more of you out there want uh, some songwriting tips and you know stuff like that also we'll be having uh, music video tips coming up it's like a series for music videos directors and uh, you know if you want to enter into directing of music videos then we'll do we'll do um final cut pros final cut pro x some tutorials some tricks um, so a lot of videos, a lot of things are coming up, all right? So back to the review of the Smart Tree and the filters for the Mavic Pro. And so today, I, I wanna give them a pass. Like, yes, um, the, the, the pictures stood quite well. The picture, uh, the, my drone is set to flat. In other words, the silly like, which means that even the 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 footage without the without the ND filter would also look good and flat, not noisy. If it is a sunny day, it still looks okay because already flattened the image. It may not be so glary, you know. But when you do the color correction, that's when you get to see, you know. The beauty and so I did for the 16 I did col color correct the well not co I didn't color correct let me not use the term wrongly that I just uh, fine-tuned the contrast and saturation I didn't touch colors blue green and red I didn't touch those none of those I just uh, I just added some contrast and then increased the um, saturation a little bit that was all I did so we'll see the footage at the end and that's it. So I'm going to leave you with that footage with the color correction or color corrected footage. And um, I'll see you in the next video. Don't forget to subscribe. Hit the notification button on the side. Like, comment, tell us what you want. Or ask your questions, what you want us to review next. And we'll be glad to do that for you. And at no cost, you buy any product on our links. Everything used in this video, including the, today's product reviewed, will be in the, the description. And when you do 
uh, click our links to buy on Amazon. We do have a commission and that's that way you support the channel at no cost to you because that's the same amount you, you will be buying if you click or do not click our link. So um, it will be, it will be, oh, do not click the link, right? Yeah. Unless, hey, it's a big crime in America. I'll see you in the next video, all right? Thank you for watching. Bye.